Hey guys, what's up? In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create this logo you're seeing on your screen in Vector Inc. I will take you through a full logo design process in Vector Inc. from start to finish in this tutorial. Using circles, we will utilize the Shape Builder tool to form our shape. Then we will apply colors using colors selected from our color palette. So without wasting much time, let's get right to the tutorial. So we are going to open a new document. Takes a few seconds to open. I'm going to turn on grid and then snap to grid. Take your circle tool and turn on constraint and scale from center. Draw a circle of any size and take your transform tool. Your circle should be selected automatically. Adjust the size of the circle to 3 grids by 3. Align it vertically to the center. Duplicate the circle and adjust it to one grid by one. Align it vertically to the center. Now, select the bigger circle and duplicate it. Move it so the upper side touches the upper side of the smaller circle. Now, select the smaller circle and duplicate it. Move it down below the inner circle. Take your line tool and draw a horizontal line meeting the lower side of the second smaller circle. Take your transform tool and select everything. Take your Shape Builder tool, turn of sculpting, and start drawing through the shapes you want to create. It's time to give our shapes and colors. You can turn off your grid at this point. Take your transform tool and select your first shape. Take your gradient tool and try swiping on the shape you have selected. You can add your colors from here. I'm going to add my color palette here. To do this, you need an image of your colors on your phone. Click on the image or gallery icon here. Choose your image. Click here to save color palette. Now cancel this. A new color palette should appear here.
So that's it. We are done creating our logo. You can now export or save it to your phone. If you like my video, please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel to not miss any of the videos I will upload in the future. Thank you for watching.